Okay, so in this quick video, this is a video response to a post on the uh, Reillusion forums regarding a character with a long shirt. And uh, I'm not exactly, you know, sure what type of a long shirt uh, you're talking about. So I went into Google Images and I found this character here. So I made a quick mock-up, you know, just quick two-minute mock-up based on this, you know, this style of shirt. Uh, seems to me like that's a long shirt, um, not a style authority. <laughs> so hopefully that's what you're asking about. Uh, so I made a quick mock-up. Okay, this is only just for time purposes. I you know threw this together in about five minutes. I used Puppet Producer to uh, to create all the the little um, the rigging and stuff and. Uh, you know, I just did the zero degree angle, no big deal, just so just we can see if it's possible. And basically what I did is uh, I separated the main uh, upper torso region by adding an additional area down here because traditionally the hip area would be right here. So the upper torso would start right here. So all I did was extend it a little bit further and actually put the hip area or the lower torso way down here at the bottom where you know it's clearly below the physical hip region of the character and uh, next uh, rather than placing uh, the pivot points or the actual bone structure you know the physical bone structure of the character where it should be you know like right there I'm actually cheating by placing them right there and uh, I exported it and imported it into Crazy Talk, and uh, this is basically the results. Okay, I did have to tweak uh, some joint masks a little bit just to kind of mask out some so some of the popping and stuff, but you know it's really not that bad. It seems like it's perfectly possible if you can deal with uh, you know this not being too dynamic. You know. Um, because it does seem a little stiff, but I think that's as best as you're going to get. And maybe tweak like uh, some of the line work right here so you don't have that gap there. Um, let's see here. I don't like the way that neck is coming up. Alright, so I think it's more than possible you know just got to use a little bit of creativity as far as where you place your pivot points and uh, it really doesn't look that bad and uh, you know it doesn't look odd you know just draw your thighs all the way up there that way you know any kind of sliding that happens uh, it'll just kind of look a little bit natural the actual dress part might look a little you know stiff but overall it's really not that bad. I think it's possible, you know? Take your time with it, be creative. I think you can do it.